Okay, in this experiment five consists of armature and the field wiring. Okay, for the field wiring, you need to connect the field wiring wire to wire to the motor, motor field wiring F1, F2. And the armature, armature go through the emitter. Okay, go to the emitter and connect to the armature of the machine. And uh, for the loop, channel 1 and channel 2, channel 1 and channel 2, connect for the same as the circuit. For the loop band, just connect the two wire. This is the loop band, the two wire, and uh, this is the generator. Okay, you separate by the shaft. When we connected the circuit ready when and the waveform we must press the auto we press the auto set function and you can get the waveform something like that. You call the waveform like that ready, you change it bigger skill for it's easy to read. Okay? And channel one and channel two try to get both same same cursor together and we try to make the waveform bigger by turning the division per second knob okay and this is not so good and we try to make the the cursor the waveform same, touching each other. Okay. In, for the firing angle, we need to use a cursor to see what is the firing angle. Okay. The, the type we change to time to measure the what is this firing angle. We try to shift it at the appropriate position and. Turn the position one to the left front, first left front point. That means the zero crossing on the side wave. And the second one, we turn this knob, follow this knife. Okay? So this is the firing angle. Now we should see the what is the delta. The delta reading is 8.2 millisecond. Next one, we want to see the what is the bad EMF of the circuit. Bad EMF is also using the cursor. In this case, we need to change it to voltage. Okay. Now we set the channel one to the first left front point to the horizontal line together with the marker. Second one, we turn this line. Same position at this line. Okay, for the source, because we using channel two as for the the firing angle, firing angle graph. So we make sure the source is channel two. Now we see the what is the reading of this back EMF? It's 360 millivolt. In, in this case. 360 millivolt. You need to multiply by the scale factor of this differential probe. It's 200. So the PNF will be 360 millivolt times 200.